Hi, Dr. Elisha Van Dusen with New Hope Chiropractic. Imagine a huge ballroom dance in which couples are whirling and twirling to the music until a single unpaired dancer enters the ballroom. He cuts in on another dancing couple, and this couple, uh, this leaves one of the original couples without a partner. This new lone dancer disrupts another couple by cutting in, and then this odd man out scenario creates chaos. A chain reaction of changing partners disrupts the dance again and again. When molecules in our body do this, it's called oxidative stress. Free radicals are molecules with a missing electron, and they seek out sources from which they can steal another electron. After they get an electron, the donor molecule is often damaged, and when this electron shuffling is widespread, it become, can become a major health problem. Oxidative um, stress from free radicals is really a natural process. Our body uses it when we exercise or fight an infection. It's a normal part of the body's intricate system of keeping itself healthy, yet when there are too many free radical problems uh, in the body, um, more health problems can result. It can contribute to a variety of modern-day inflammatory diseases, conditions like diabetes, atherosclerosis, heart disease, and high blood pressure can um, be the result of that. Even Alzheimer's, Parkinson's, cancer, and many neurological diseases are implicated too. So what's the solution to this? Well, having one more dancer enter the room can reduce this ballroom chaos. And in the body, that's what an antioxidant does. Antioxidants are molecules that can donate an electron without making themselves unstable. And this causes the free radical to stabilize and become less reactive. And the good news is that there are two key strategies that you can use to fight free radicals in your body. Number one is reduce exposure. The old adage, when you find yourself in a hole, stop digging, comes to mind here. And look for ways to reduce oxidative, oxidative stress in your body. So this can include things like reducing your exposure to ozone, pesticides, tobacco smoke, and pollution. Reduce alcohol and sugar intake in all its forms as well. Number two is increase antioxidants. Our body relies on the foods we eat to provide antioxidants. And so damage from free radicals requires becoming more mindful of our diet, considering adding some grapes, blueberries, nuts, dark veggies, uh, root veggies, beans, and fish. Limit processed meats as much as possible, like sausages, bacon, and salami. And as with so many things in the body, we need balance. We need the right amount of free radicals and the right amount of antioxidants to keep them in check and keep that balance going. So I uh, hope this helps, uh, especially um, around the holiday season where we put a lot more stress in our bodies. And also remember to get yourself adjusted on a regular basis because we live our lives through our nervous system and um, healthier nervous system equals um, healthier life. Check us out at newhopechiropractic.com and have a very healthy day.